The Sobel operator, sometimes called Sobel filter, is used in image processing and computer vision, particularly within edge detection algorithms, and creates an image which emphasizes edges and transitions. It is named after Erwin Sobel, who presented the idea of an isotropic 3x3 image gradient operator at a talk at the Stanford Artificial Intelligence Project in 1968. Technically, it is a discrete differentiation operator, computing an approximation of the gradient of the image intensity function. At each point in the image, the result of the Sobel operator is either the corresponding gradient vector or the norm of this vector. The Sobel operator is based on convolving the image with a small, separable, and integer valued filter in horizontal and vertical direction and is therefore relatively inexpensive in terms of computations. On the other hand, the gradient approximation that it produces is relatively crude, in particular for high frequency variations in the image. The Kaoli operator for edge detection is another operator generated from Sobel operator. Formulation the operator uses two 3A, 3 kernels which are convolved with the original image to calculate approximations of the derivatives, one for horizontal changes, and one for vertical. If we define A as the source image, and GX and Gray are two images which at each point contain the horizontal and vertical derivative approximations, the computations are as follows. Where here denotes the two-dimensional convolution operation. Since the Sobel kernels can be decomposed as the products of an averaging and a differentiation kernel, they compute the gradient with smoothing. For example, can be written as The x-coordinate is defined here as increasing in the right direction, and the y-coordinate is defined as increasing in the down direction. At each point in the image, the resulting gradient approximations can be combined to give the gradient magnitude, using Using this information, we can also calculate the gradient's direction. Where, for example, I is zero for a vertical edge which is lighter on the right side. More formally, since the intensity function of a digital image is only known at discrete points, derivatives of this function cannot be defined unless we assume that there is an underlying continuous intensity function which has been sampled at the image points. With some additional assumptions, the derivative of the continuous intensity function can be computed as a function on the sampled intensity function, that is the digital image. It turns out that the derivatives at any particular point are functions of the intensity values at virtually all image points. However, approximations of these derivative functions can be defined at lesser or larger degrees of accuracy. The Sobel operator represents a rather inaccurate approximation of the image gradient, but is still of sufficient quality to be of practical use in many applications. More precisely, it uses intensity values only in a 3A, 3 region around each image point to approximate the corresponding image gradient, and it uses only integer values for the coefficients which weight the image intensities to produce the gradient approximation. Extension to other dimensions, the Sobel operator consists of two separable operations, smoothing perpendicular to the derivative direction with a triangle filter, simple central difference in the derivative direction a, Sobel filters for image derivatives in different dimensions with a, 1D, 2D, 3D, 4D, thus as an example the 3D Sobel kernel in Z direction. Technical details, as a consequence of its definition, the Sobel operator can be implemented by simple means in both hardware and software. Only eight image points around a point are needed to compute the corresponding result and only integer arithmetic is needed to compute the gradient vector approximation. Furthermore, the two discrete filters described above are both separable. And the two derivatives gx and gray can therefore be computed as. In certain implementations, this separable computation may be advantageous since it implies fewer arithmetic computations for each image point. Applying convolution K to pixel group P can be represented in pseudocode as N, X, Y, equals sum of K, I, J, P, X, I, Y, J, for I, J running from minus 1 to 1. N, X, Y, represents the new matrix resulted after applying the convolution K to P where P is pixel matrix. Example the result of the Sobel operator is a two-dimensional map of the gradient at each point. 
it can be processed and viewed as though it is itself an image, with the areas of high gradient visible as white lines. The following images illustrates this, by showing the computation of the Sobel operator on a simple image. Alternative operators, the Sobel operator, while reducing artifacts associated with a pure central differences operator, does not have perfect rotational symmetry. Scar looked into optimizing this property. Filter kernels up to size 5x5 have been presented there, but the most frequently used one is. This factors similarly. Scar operators result from an optimization minimizing weighted mean squared angular error and Fourier domain. This optimization is done under the condition that resulting filters are numerically consistent. Therefore they really are derivative kernels rather than merely keeping symmetry constraints. A similar optimization strategy and resulting filters were also presented by Farid and Simon Selly. They also investigate higher order derivative schemes. In contrast to the work of SCAR, these filters are not enforced to be numerically consistent. The problem of derivative filter design has been revisited for example by Kroon. Derivative filters based on arbitrary cubic splines was presented by Hasty showed how first and second order derivatives can be computed correctly using cubic or trigonometric splines by a double filtering approach giving filters of length 7. Orientation optimal derivative kernels drastically reduce systematic estimation errors in optical flow estimation. Larger schemes with even higher accuracy and optimized filter families for extended optical flow estimation have been presented in subsequent work by SCAR. Second order derivative filter sets have been investigated for transparent motion estimation. It has been observed that the larger the resulting kernels are, the better they approximate derivative of Gaussian filters. Example comparisons, here, four different gradient operators are used to estimate the magnitude of the gradient of the test image. See also, digital image processing, computer vision, edge detection, feature detection, feature extraction, image gradient, Roberts cross, PWIT operator, Laplace operator, Sobel and Kaoli edge detection comparison, references. Erwin Sobel, 2014, History and Definition of the Sobel Operator, Feature Detectors, Sobel Edge Detector, K. Engel. Real Time Volume Graphics, PPA 112 Euro 114 A, SCAR, Hanno, 2000, Dissertation, Optimal Operators in Digital Image Processing. B. Jar Currency HNE, H. SCAR, and S. Car Paragraph RKEL. Principles of Filter Design. In Handbook of Computer Vision and Applications. Academic Press, 1999. H. Farid and E. P. Simon Selly, Optimally Rotation Equivariant Directional Derivative Kernels, International Conf Computer Analysis of Images and Patterns, pages 207, 214, September 1997. H. Farid and E. P. Simon Selly, Differentiation of Discrete Multidimensional Signals, i.e. E. Trans Image Processing, Volume 13, 4, pages 496, 508, April 2004. D. Kroon, 2009, Short Paper University Twent, Numerical Optimization of Kernel-Based Image Derivatives. A. Hast, Simple Filter Design for First and Second Order Derivatives by a Double Filtering Approach. Pattern Recognition Letters, Volume 42, Number 1 June, pages 65, 71. 2014. SCAR, Hanno, Optimal Filters for Extended Optical Flow in, Jar Currency HNE, B, Master, R, Bath, E, SCAR, HIWCM 2004. LNCS, Volume 3417, pages 14 Euro 29. Springer, Heidelberg. SCAR, Hanno, Optimal Second Order Derivative Filter Families for Transparent Motion Estimation 15th European Signal Processing Conference, Potsdam, Poland, September 3, Euro 7, 2007. External links, Sobel Edge Detection in OPENCV, Sobel Filter, in the SciPy Python Library, Bibliographic Citations for Erwin Sobel in DBLP, Sobel and SCAR 5x5 gradients, 
Sobel edge detection example using computer algorithms, Sobel and Kaoli edge detection comparison.